Louisa is in Natick with a look at the conditions there. Louisa? Well, Lisa David, it's still cold, it's still blustery, but somehow today we found people who were trying to find the bright side of this storm. Kids who were obviously out in the snow and playing. And then here, there are a whole bunch of utility crews that have been coming and going all throughout the day. Well, they've been taking advantage of one of the only restaurants that's open. Yeah. That's some impressive skills, I mean. Yeah. How long do you think you're going to stay out here for? Uh, an hour or an hour and 30 minutes. In this cold? Yeah, it's not that bad. <laughs> I was trying to do it day and I fell. <laughs> Harder than it looks, huh? Yes, very. You need to have good balance. You gotta do what you gotta do. Welcome to New England, right? 170 rooms booked, you know, so we expected anywhere between 150 and 200 servicemen to come through. We've got a long-standing relationship with Eversource so, and National Grid, so we're always happy when, when everybody else rolls up the sidewalks, we open up the doors and bring them on in. So you want to see something interesting? These tables have been here uncovered all day, and this shows you the powdery snow and the power of the wind. There is no snow on top of these tables, while well, nearby, there's a big fat drift, and the storm here in Natick continues to do its thing. Live in Natick, Louisa Moeller, WBZ News.